Cincinnati is well known for its German heritage, but the Irish have left a mark as well. Janelle Walton discovers that the blue chip city has quite a lot of green around town. In the melting pot of Cincinnati, maybe the German beer stein should be served with Irish corned beef and cabbage. There's a whole lot of German heritage here, but there's a whole lot of other ethnic heritage too. And particularly with the Irish. Kevin Grace, the author of Irish Cincinnati, has documented Ireland's impact on early Cincinnati. Mount Adams was a strong Irish working class neighborhood for a very long time. Uh, down along the river on the east side was very Irish. Irish history is sprinkled all around town. In 1821, Christ Church, the first Irish Catholic church, was built on Liberty and Vine, where St. Francis Seraph Church is now located. Kevin says the congregation moved in 1826, but the tombstones of the Irish parishioners are still in the basement. The book goes on to list other Irish connections. James Gamble, one of the founders of Procter & Gamble, was born in Northern Ireland. The founders of Pogue's department store were Irish brothers, and the first archbishop of the Archdiocese of Cincinnati was Irishman John Baptist Purcell. And we can't leave you without a list of places to celebrate the Irish culture on St. Patrick's Day. Crowley's, Haps, Molly Malone's, the, those would serve you well, I think. Although Great American Ballpark isn't in the swing of the season yet, the Reds are in Goodyear, Arizona, and have a seat waiting just for you. Ballpark supervisors say you've got the best chance of catching a foul ball if you sit down the first baseline. Looking to add to your autograph collection? Our premium field box seats are the first two rows from the dugout to the outfield, and those are the best places to grab player autographs before the game. For a family affair, the berm is your best bet. Little ones can spread out, run around, and they're not confined to the seats. Fans in the berm can also enjoy the players warming up in the bullpen, so they can stand over and watch them, them warm up prior to them hitting the field. For The List, I'm Janelle Walton.